combining document groups for further analysis in Atlas TI-9 windows. You can combine document groups in the Document Manager and save the results as so-called smart groups. Here we have selected the two document groups, Gender Female and Marital Status Married. To retrieve female respondents who are married, both of these criteria must apply, and therefore we need to set the operator to All. This result can now be saved as a smart group for later reuse. You can accept the default name or enter a new name. We show the process one more time by creating a smart group for male respondents who are married. By the way, smart groups are smart because they update themselves. If you add more documents to your project that you classify into the base group Gender Male and Marital Status Married, then these documents will automatically be added to the smart group. You can also combine all members of two or more groups to form a larger group. For example, by combining all respondents who have one or two children. Here, instead of using all, you select the operator any. Then create a smart group again. You can also use smart groups to build other smart groups. Here we combine the group Educational Level University Degree with the newly created smart group Having One or Two Children. Then we save this combination as a smart group as well. So how can smart groups be useful for the analysis process? Here you see the code document table where you can cross-tabulate document groups with codes. We have selected two of our newly created smart groups, married male and married female respondents, and we want to compare what reasons they have mentioned for having children. We can add a further layer to the analysis by adding a global filter. This is most conveniently done in the Project Explorer. Open the Document Group branch, select a group, right-click, and select the option Set Global Filter. The results in the table change accordingly. Global filters can also be applied to the results of the code co-occurrence table. The table shows you the number of co-occurrences as they occur in the entire project. By setting a document group or a smart group as a global filter, you can restrict the results to a particular group of respondents.